Hello, everybody, and welcome to NCAA via SBF. Tonight, we've got UNC taking on UConn Huskies versus Tar Heels. The tip-off. Josh Robinson wins the tip-off for UNC. UNC's got three user players. Brendan Woodson, who has the ball now. Alessandro Carter, the point guard. Josh Robinson, the center. There are two AI players, Hal Woodridge and Tracy Fleming, the power forward and small forward, respectively, is uh, Brendan Woodson cuts in for a layup. McBean gets a screen from Jack Morgan. And with the contact finishes, Lightning McBean so good at that. Woodson with the ball. It's to Alessandro Carter. Alessandro, normally the person who runs this team's offense. Fleming wide open. Three. And for UConn, you have the Morgan brothers, Jack and Jason Morgan, at the power and small forward positions. And you have Lightning McBean at point guard. All 5 4 of Lightning McBean. And off the glass, no good for Jack Morgan. Jason covering Tracy Fleming's. Missed. Woodson puts it up and in. Charles Shepard and Joel Embiid Jr. as the two AI players for, U uh, for UConn. Jason Morgan. Gets it to Jack. Mismatch down low. He's getting double teamed. He loses the ball. Loses the ball again. Great defense from Alessandro. Fades away. It's good. Jack Morgan so good at those turnaround shots. Great defense and Jack just turned around for an awesome shot there. No good on the shot from Fleming there. Jason Morgan gets two screens, goes at the rim, adjusts, no good, rebounded by Brennan Woodson. Carter, guarded by McBean. Drives by him and puts it in with the left hand. Bean struggling so far this year with a defense down low, understandable with the size, more than makes up for it with their speed. And Jason Morgan misses the three, but Jack gets it, rebounds it, and misses the putback. Fleming gets it to Carter. Carter steps to the side for a three, no good. Got a little bit of space there, but couldn't get that one to go in. McBean, no good on the mid-range. Rebounded by Jack Morgan, who puts in the little hook. Robinson to Woodson. Woodson to Fleming. Fleming wide open for three. Drains it. Lightning McBean now. Guarded by Alessandro Carter. Now being guarded by the large power forward Hal Woodridge. Gets blocked easily. Fleming with the ball. Gets it to Robinson down low, getting double teamed, doesn't care, puts it in. Josh Robinson, an excellent finisher down low, very high percentage, scoring a lot this season so far, and can they ease up on that trumpet? Thank you. Jack Morgan, no good on the layup there. Carter. Gets it to, uh, to Fleming, no good.
Jason Morgan wide open for three, no good. Another open shot for Morgan, doesn't fall. Fleming driving to the rim, gets it to Robinson down low, misses. Lightning with the ball. Guarded by Woodson, screen. Jason off the glass and in. Alessandro Carter bringing up the ball. Alessandro Carter spreading the ball out a lot more this game, letting everybody touch the ball. And he gets the lay in after beating McBean off the dribble. So far, it has been working so far for UNC's offensive game plan. Last time we saw Alessandro in one of these games, a lot of isolation. A lot of him kicking it out for the th uh, for the assist, but so far he's been moving the ball around as some good team basketball. And UNC up early in this one, eight to sixteen. UConn managing to find some open shots, just not sinking them, falling behind early. McBean looks to change that. Gets it to Charles Shepard. Jack Morgan to Jason Morgan. Driving on Fleming with the left hand and in off the glass. Alessandro Carter off the cut and one. Too much contact down low for McBean trying to stop the cut. That's going to be a three-point opportunity for Alessandro Carter. And he converts it. MB Jr., AI player. To Lightning, to the other AI player, Charles Shepard. Jason Morgan. Waiting for someone to cut. Not finding anybody. Gets it to McBean in the post. Not the greatest idea. Kicks out to MB Jr. for the fadeaway three. Heavily contested by Brandon Woodson. Rebounded by UConn. Another contested jump shot. No good from UConn. Carter. Slips, uh, McBean slips that screen from Carter, manages to stay on him, but the switch down low as Alessandro tries to take it on the much bigger Jack Morgan with no success. McBean gets under the defender, puts it up and in off the glass. A big advantage to McBean's size is it very much fits his skill set. And there's the cut and the dunk from Hal Woodridge. UNC's offense staying very mobile. McBean wide open for three. That's good. And those are the kind of shots that UConn's going to need to stay in this game if UNC's offense stays clicking. And the spin, the lay-in recovered by, uh, by Shepard. McBean beat off the dribble, but he has defensive help. Carter normally doesn't take many shots where he gets blocked. Normally you see him kick out in those situations. But he, oh wow, the cut and the dunk from Robinson. But as I was saying, a lot of the time you don't really beat your guy off the dribble that much. And you just go straight up the rim with no regard for any defensive help. And the switch down low gives him some space. No good. Alessandro Carter up top. Gets a screen from Woodridge. Tries to go by McBean. Misses too strong. Rebounded by Jack Morgan. McBean in transition. They're going to slow it down. 
Big Bean's gonna try to take it himself. Gets it to Jack. Puts it in. Alessandro Carter waiting for the screen. Gets it from Woodson. Woodson switched up. And put back in from ja uh, Josh Robinson. Big Bean gets it to his big man. Jason with the ball now. Didn't see the cut. Getting it to McBean in the post. Not something McBean is great at. They're going to be forced to take a jump shot here. And that's too strong. And almost corralled by UConn. Pulled in by Josh Robinson. And wide open three from the corner. Misses from Tracy Fleming. Carter. Double team. Gets it to Fleming again for three. And that's good. Guarded by Woodson. Gets it to Jason. He's got two seconds to shoot. He's going to be forced to shoot a contested three. That's short. Rebounded by Hal Woodridge. UNC in transition. Woodson fouled going up. Woodson, not a bad free throw shooter, sinks his first shot. And the second shot. Puts UNC up 13. Minute 26 to go in the half. McBean with the ball. Gets it to Jack Morgan. Up top is the big man, Shepard. Waiting for his cuts. Not seeing anything. Gets it back to the point guard. McBean with contact. Puts it in. What a beautiful layup that was. And the three-point play is converted. Just a 10-point deficit now for you, uh, for UConn. The screen from Carter, the Fleming shot, no good. Jason gets fouled on his way up by Hal Woodridge. UConn now in the bonus, not with a lot of time left in the half, though. The first shot is good for Jason. And so is the second. Alessandro now. Cutting. Bean didn't, McBean didn't see him cut. Wide open to the rim. Green from Morgan goes the other way. Gets matched up on the power forward. Goes up strong anyway. No good. Big Bean fearless, but in that situation, it hurt him. Carter going up. Gets blocked by Jack Morgan. Jack Morgan, one player that is very difficult to drive against. Big Bean now guarded by Alessandro. Jason. Going to be forced to take the last shot. Doesn't get it off in time anyways, it looks like. And we're going into halftime with a decent lead for, US, uh, for UNC. UNC looking like they got a different game plan going into this one. Moving the ball around a lot more than they normally do. Letting other people control the ball. Doing their best to try to get shots from the post. So far, it looks like it's working. UConn putting a lot of trust in Jason Morgan so far. Very inconsistent offense from him, but good looks being taken. And all you can really ask for is good looks. Bean gets it to Jason now. 
fakes the fadeaway. Goes at the rim, gets fouled on the way up. Both of these Morgan brothers known for that long striding fadeaway. They definitely didn't invent the move, but they are making it popular in college. No good from Alessandro. Rebounded by Josh Robinson. Puts it up and in. Robinson's so effective when he gets that offensive rebound. Almost a guarantee that it's going back in. McBean with the layup. Carter and McBean have been so efficient against each other. Neither of these players really able to stop the other one. Fleming, deep two, that's good. That is one part of Jason Morgan's game that likely needs to be improved before he goes to the pros, is that perimeter defense. Definitely not a very big minus defender, and there's the cut and the lane from Woolridge. But definitely something that needs to be worked on if you're gonna play the small forward position. Driving on Carter, backed up by Woodson, blocked by Carter. Now Woodson laying it up, off the glass and in. Moving it around up top is Yukon. Morgan with the ball. Morgan likes to try to create shots for himself, but he's not going to force anything. And just a very bad play from UConn. They don't design anything to get close to the rim. They're just forced to shoot a near half quarter. Alessandro, no good there. Rebounded by Jack Morgan. McBean with the ball. Gets the screen, goes up against the center. No good, almost swatted and almost put in. Woodson. Gets it to Fleming, three pointer, no good. Morgan able to close out a little bit faster than normal this time. Losing the dribble is Jason, but Jack recovers it, puts it up and off the glass. The brother comes in and says, I got your back. Carter to Woodson. Woodson to Fleming for three. That one's good. Morgan having trouble keeping up with the smaller Tracy Fleming, the AI player. Jack Morgan. It's a dead B Jr. has the size mismatch, but definitely not the strength mismatch. Alessandro Carter gets the rebound himself too. Alessandro Carter, one of the stronger pound for pound guards. Josh Robinson, contested shot is good. UNC building up a big lead here, trying to end the third quarter with breathing room. As McBean misses the layup, Woodson with the ball now in transition. They're gonna slow it down. He's gonna find Carter on the cut on McBean. Lays it in. And B Jr. is gonna fire up the three. No good, rebounded by uh, Josh Robinson. Hal Woodridge gets blocked hard, but it's a foul. And Josh Robinson flopped there for no reason. Woolridge 
Savage makes the first shot. Misses the second. Morgan bringing up the ball. Bean in the corner, not running the offense right now. Gets it to Embiid. To Jack, who's going to try to back the smaller man down. He's getting double teamed. He's going to have to pass out. Good defense there by UNC as they're going to be forced to take a shot here with two seconds left over Woodson. He makes it! McBean with the prayer shot makes it. Woodson dunks it on the other end. Probably frustrated for playing amazing defense and allowing a three. Slams it in on the other end, letting out some pent-up frustration. Woodson having a much better game this game than he did last time. Guarded by McBean. He's going to wait for the screen. Doesn't get it. Gets it to Robinson. Finds Carter down low off the glass and in. Bean dribbling, gets the jump shot. That's good. Carter with the ball. Four seconds left. He's going to take the last shot. Mid-range over McBean and in. And that's just how tonight's gone. Fourth quarter rolling around. Assist of the game. Goes to Brendan Woodson to that cut to Alessandro. Starter staying in for now. 21 point lead, not comfortable enough for UNC. Woodridge driving on Jack Morgan, nothing there. Calling for it in the corner. And B drives, gets blocked, puts it back up. No good. Rebounded by Woodson. Woodson lays it up. No good. Gets his own rebound. Up again. No good. Rebounded by Robinson. That time it's up. It's good. And the big men not able to stop UNC from getting a few offensive boards there. Jack Morgan up top. Actually, that's Jason. Now it's Jack Morgan. Guarded by Carter. Has to foul him. He had a little bit of defensive help, but he probably wouldn't have got there in time. Probably a smart foul by Carter there. Jason Morgan is his brother as Jack Morgan shoots his second free throw and makes both. And there's the cut. Immediate offense from UNC. Alessandro Carter, as you can see, leading the league in assists per game. Has done a magnificent job of running this offense so far in this game. Just an absolute artwork. Fleming open, fading three. That's good. Jason Morgan having trouble all night sticking to Tracy Fleming. Jack sets the screen. McBean finds MB Jr. and Woodson fouls him. No assist for McBean. As he got MB wide open for that layup. Alessandro 
Sets it up, waits for a screen, wants to attack the rim, and he does, puts it in off the glass, doesn't even get contact. Alessandro Carter just has so many moves in his arsenal, it's hard to predict where he's going to go and what he's going to do. And a little bit of space for McBean is all he needs as he drains the mid-range. Carter finds Woodson down low, lays it in. These cuts have been murdering UConn. Jason Morgan, wide open three. That's good. This game, if it wasn't already, has pretty much entered the it's over territory. But both of these teams still playing their absolute best. Because this isn't just about the win. This is also about showing up and showing what you can do to the pro scouts that are watching this game too. Watching your every move on the college court. And Jack Morgan on the cut and the dunk. Good pass from McBean. Robinson getting double teamed. Doesn't care. Puts it in. Robinson is not afraid of double teams if there isn't somebody who can physically impose the way he does. Jason against Fleming. Passes out. MB Jr. The screen. Doesn't get it. Woodson sticks to him like glue and forces the miss. Woodson setting the screen. Gets the switch. Guarded by MB Jr. Stops, pulls up, misses. Rebound to UConn. UConn in transition. Jason setting it up. Gets it to McBean. McBean going to drive, kick it out to jo uh, Joel Embiid Jr. Going to get stopped in his tracks by Woodson and misses. Good defense there. Minute left. The spin from Alessandro. The alley-oop. And it is stopped in midair. Corner three. No good from Jason Morgan. Carter drives, gets his open jump shot, makes it, moving just past the free throw line. UNC not stopping here, laying on the gas to end the game. Trying to make a statement. Big Bean fade away, gets the shot. Both of these point guards have been so impressive this game, offensively. Carter's at least got a block and some decent good defensive plays, but McBean has definitely been lacking in that category. 12 seconds left, we'll see if they take another shot. As this one comes to a close, it was a blowout, almost door to door. UNC dominating this win. Jason Morgan misses the three. Knocked out of bounds with 0.8 seconds left. They're probably not going to have enough time for an actual shot. As they put in the bench unit anyways. And there's the end of the game. Hope you guys had fun regardless. If you haven't yet, comment. Make sure you get your points. This has been Lion, a.k.a. Kenneth Michael, a.k.a. the Talons GM, signing off.